Britney Spears was spotted at Soho House in Malibu with her ex-boyfriend, Paul Richard Solis, who is a convicted felon. On Tuesday, the 42-year-old celebrity and her felon seemed to have supper together at the popular restaurant for celebrities. Their encounter occurred a few weeks after the pop diva announced on her Instagram stories that she was single as F asterisk asterisk K. Britney seemed to have been dating the offender for a few months before making her surprising announcement. Paul, the father of nine kids at least, was being pursued by the children's mother in May for unpaid child support and the Los Angeles Department of Child Services. With a white jean short and a purple and white top, Britney cut a carefree figure. She accessorized with a straw hat and slip-on sandals. Paul wore sneakers and pants with a blue and white plaid button-up shirt over a baggy white tee. In a very open post about being single at the beginning of July, Britney alluded to her breakup with Paul. The mistake. The singer of I Did It Again announced on Instagram that she was single as F asterisk 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 dot. Her attitude is savage, but her heart is gold, said Instagram user at Therendomvabies, according to a quote she uploaded. What was more intriguing, though, was the caption she removed from the photo she posted with her Instagram followers. Single as F asterisk asterisk asterisk, it said. As long as I live, I will never be with another man. She had been seeing Paul for the past few months, so the post arrived at an intriguing moment. He was supposedly the Hitney Baby singer's lover after initially being connected to her as a handyman and cleaner on her crew. In a previous Instagram story, she had accused Solis of collaborating with the photographers. Solis was already the father of nine children back in May, and the Los Angeles Department for Child Support Services, DCSS as well as the children's mother are pursuing him for child support. Despite Solis's cheating on her with Brittany and his unpaid bills for both his five children with her and his other children with other women, Nicole Mancilla, 36, stated that she still makes an effort to see her at her mother's house in Silmar, California. Tell them that my spouse got caught in Britney Spears' p asterisk 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 dot. Mancilla remarked, He was married, but he denies having children now. He ignores his kids in favor of her. Only a few days prior to that shocking revelation, Spears had broken her silence by claiming that she had twisted her ankle following an alleged brawl at the Chateau Marmont with her felon lover. She had even announced that she was moving to Boston. On Thursday, May 2nd, the singer posted a long message on Instagram that contained some shocking allegations, such as the idea that the paramedics entered her room at the storied Sunset Boulevard Hotel. Illegally. Just to let people know, the news is fake, she wrote. Right now, I would like it if people could recognize that I am growing stronger every day. Since the truth stinks, could someone please teach me how to lie? Sobbing laughing emoji? Goddesses everywhere. I'm connecting with my higher self and I sincerely hope you are too. Require a new toothbrush immediately. Emojis for rolling eyes, laughing while sobbing, monkey covering eyes, and champagne bottle. P.S. Six pink rose emojis. I need an espresso. I'm not sure why I feel compelled to share this, but P.S.S. The celebrity announced her new major U.S. city of residence and attempted to explain why she felt the need to clarify herself in the closing moments of her announcement. I guess I'm just a girl and I'm on my period so I'm be asterisk 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 why s asterisk asterisk asterisk. Brittany went on. Last night... I also twisted my ankle, and paramedics arrived at my house without authorization. They never entered my room, but I still felt like I was being tormented. I'm heading to Boston, sweetheart. Emoji of peace hand sign. At the time, though, a person close to Brittany claimed. She was out in Hollywood celebrating the finalization of her divorce. In order to make sure they wouldn't be held accountable for any injuries she had, Someone from the hotel contacted the ambulance after she twisted her ankle there. When the ambulance comes, the police come. The insider continues. The blanket and pillow were there since she was sleeping when they got there. They checked her over and decided it was nothing serious, so they left. She was obviously taken aback by this. She is not relocating to Boston either. This is in response to the shocking images of the barefoot actress being led out to emergency services that surfaced in the early hours of Thursday morning at the Chateau Marmont, raising fears about a mental health crisis. Spears, who has caused more and more concern with her recent conduct and is said to be
completely dysfunctional, was spotted leaving the hotel in scenes reminiscent of her 2008 collapse. She was observed clutching a pillow, looking concerned, and wearing only her panties. Spears was unkempt, topless, and had abrasions on her knees as she clutched the pillow to her chest, her security encircling her and her felon ex Paul. Reportedly, Brittany and the other woman got into a heated argument, and the woman was allegedly harassing and threatening hotel personnel and guests. A fire vehicle was also spotted at the Hollywood Hotel, and a man was observed dragging a stretcher bearing the star's stuff on it. Spears also sent a troubling Instagram comment in which she declared that she was getting stronger every day, and asserted that the images were of body doubles. Most of the pictures are body doubles, and I think most know that, the writer stated. Right now, I would like it if people could recognize that I am growing stronger every day. Can someone please teach me how to lie? The truth stinks. Goddesses everywhere. I'm connecting with my higher self and I sincerely hope you all are as well. Right now, I really need a new toothbrush. P.S. I'm craving an espresso. P.S. I'm not sure why, but I feel like sharing this. I suppose I'm just a girl. And because I'm having my period, I'm grumpy. S asterisk asterisk T. People. Emergency services received a call at 12.42 a.m. reporting that an adult female had been hurt, according to LAFD spokesman Brian Humphrey. An ambulance showed up there at 1 in the morning. I can attest that nobody was taken by car. By 1.17 a.m., services had departed the scene. The cops did not receive a call. Police were summoned in response to a reported disturbance involving a lady who matched the singer's description and was allegedly harassing and threatening hotel employees and guests. When Spears arrived at the hotel late on Wednesday, May 1st, officers in attendance saw no indications of a problem and left. Around 11 o'clock at night, the two went back to their room and partied and drank. It is reported that they engaged in a serious physical altercation, during which Spears may have hurt her leg. Paramedics were summoned because it was reported that Spears was screaming and out of control in the hallway of her suite. And some guests believed she was experiencing a mental breakdown. Spears is reported to have departed without Solis and with her security, refusing to board an ambulance. In an Instagram video from February of this year, the toxic hitmaker dispelled reports that she was dating Paul. Spears said that she has a hopeless romantic understanding that being single is awesome. Next to a video of the celebrity showcasing her dancing abilities. Brittany and Paul are definitely together. The insider told us weekly at the time, adding, He's still in the picture. Additionally, in September of last year, a different informant disclosed that Brittany and Paul had a short fling, but otherwise claimed they are not dating. Brittany slept with him twice, not knowing about his criminal history at the time. She is no longer in contact with him. According to court records, Paul has a history of offenses, including possession of a firearm in December 2022 while working for Brittany. Following an alleged probation violation, Solis was heard in the San Fernando Superior Court in September 2023. One day after checking herself out of an Antigua rehab center in 2007, Brittany made headlines when she shaved her head at a hair salon in Tarzana, a suburb of Los Angeles. Later on, Brittany resumed her medical care. On February 1, 2008, Spears was placed under conservatorship by Judge Reva Getz, who appointed her father Jamie Spears and lawyer Andrew M. Wallet as conservators. This occurred after she refused to give her ex-husband Kevin Federline custody of her sons. As a result, she was admitted to the Ronald Reagan UCLA Medical Center's psych unit and put on a 5,150 psychiatric hold. By year's end, what had started out as a temporary arrangement had turned into a permanent one. In the years that followed, Brittany was judged fit to work in a hybrid business model, as described in court documents by the former estate conservator, but not well enough to manage her personal life. The New York Times said that the estate kept tabs on her acquaintances, where she could go, and even tracked every purchase she made, down to a Starbucks cup. In addition, Brittany testified in court that she was coerced into taking medicine and using birth control against her will. Ma'am, my dad and everybody involved in this conservatorship, and my management, who played significant roles in punishing me when I said no to going on tour, ma'am, they should be in jail, she told the judge during one court appearance. During her conservatorship, she kept working and releasing records. 
However, in 2019, she checked herself back into a mental health facility as a result of stress brought on by her father Jamie's near-fatal colon rupture. The conservatorship ended in November 2021 when it was reported in 2019 that Spears was being detained against her will. This led to the hashtag Free Britney movement. After a mere 14 months of marriage and a nine-month legal separation, Spears and her third husband Hezem, Sam, Askery eventually reached a settlement in May.